it's nice to see you again. My name is Dara. Dara. Dara Van Remortel. Yeah, call me Dara. I'd like to thank the Abbott Public Library for sponsoring my program today. Thank you so much, Abbott Public Library in Marblehead, Marblehead, Massachusetts. All right, let's start singing. I like to sing. Do you like to sing? Good morning, good morning, and how are you? Good morning. ZYX. So here's how we do it. It's fun. It's fun. I made these charts. These are going to help us out. All right. So it's the ABC song. But instead of singing A, B, C, D, E, F, G, we're going to sing it backwards. Z, Y, X, W, V, U, T. And this is going to help because it's kind of confusing. You might get mixed up.
together. Should we try it one last time? One last time. ABCs? Let's do that. Switch the felt board. Can you close your eyes? We'll make it a surprise. No peeking, please. Close your eyes. When I count to five, that's when you can open. One, two, three, four, five. You may open your eyes. What do you see on the felt board? Yes, apples and bananas. Yes, apples and bananas. All right, so. Along with the apples and bananas, do you also see some letters down here? The letter E. Do you know what letter that is? A. A. Do you know what letter that is? I. I. Do you know what letter that is? O. Very good. And that letter is U. Good. This song is called Apples and Bananas. I like to eat, eat, eat apples and bananas. Do you like to eat apples and bananas? Raise your hand if you do. Yum. Yum, me too. They're yummy fruits. So first we're going to sing, I like to eat, eat, eat apples and bananas. I like to eat, eat, eat apples and bananas. Then we're going to do something silly. 
with these letters. You follow along, you're gonna catch on. I have a feeling you will. Starts like this. I like to eat, eat, eat apples and bananas. I like to eat, eat, eat apples and bananas. Now we take the letter E there. I like to eat, eat, eat apples and bananas. tells you to. Stand up please on your two feet please. Listen and do as the song tells you to. Six. 
six, seven, eight, nine, ten. You may open your eyes. What do you see? It's the apple tree with bananas. No, oh, no, it's not a banana tree. Apple tree, yes, with apples. Let's count them. One, two, three, four, five. What color? Red. Yes, all right, hold up five fingers. This one goes like this. Farmer Joe had five red apples hanging from his tree. I asked him if I could pick one and have it just for me. Do you know what he said? And then you're going to say, what did he say? And shrug your shoulders like you're asking a question. What did he say? He said, sure, I love to share. So I picked one off, pretend to pick off an apple, and I wiped it clean. It was the shiniest apple I'd ever seen. So I took a bite. And I crunched some more until all I had left was the apple core. Oh no, it's all gone. All right, I'm going to put this one back and now we'll do it with the music. Farmer Joe had five red apples hanging from his tree. I asked him if I could pick one and have it just for me. Do you know what he said? Your turn. What did he say? He said, sure, I love to share. So I picked one off, pick it off, hey boy, picked one off, and I wiped it clean. It was the shiniest apple I'd ever seen. So I took a bite and I crunched some more until all I had left was the apple core. Oh no, it's all gone. How many are left? One, two, three, four. sure I love to share. So I picked one off and I wiped it clean. It was the shiniest apple I've ever seen. So I took a bite and I crunched some more until all I had left was the apple core. Oh no, it's all gone. How many are left? One, two, wiped it clean. It was the shiniest apple I've ever seen. So I took a bite and I crunched some more until all I had left was the apple core. Oh no, it's all gone. How many are left? One, two. Farmer Joe had two red apples hanging from his tree. was the shiniest apple I've ever seen. So I took a bite and I crunched some more until all I had left was the apple core. Oh no, it's all gone. How many left? Farmer Joe had one red apple hanging from his tree. I asked him if he would like one instead of just me. Do you know what he said? What did he say? He said, sure, I appreciate that. Thank you. So he picked one off and he wiped it clean. It was the shiniest apple he'd ever seen. So he took a bite and he crunched some more until all he had left was the apple core. Yum, that was good. Yay. Nice job. Old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O. And on that farm he had a... Any guesses? 
guesses? Any guesses? What do you think it's going to be? Did you guess a pig? If you guessed a pig, you're right. A pig. E-I-E-I-O. What does a pig say? With an oink, oink here. And an oink, oink there. Here and oink, there and oink. Everywhere and oink, oink. Old McDonald had a farm. E-I-E-I-O. And on that farm, he had a... Want to try to guess? What do you think it's going to be? acorns or nuts with a here and a there here a there a everywhere a take the others away. Do you know what squirrels like to eat? Yeah, nuts, berries, uh-huh. Acorns, it's kind of a nut. But these aren't nuts that we would eat, right? You wouldn't eat acorns that you find outside. No, maybe in some soup, acorn soup or acorn squash. That's yummy, acorn squash. Yeah, but these kind of acorns, I would not put these in my mouth. Oh. But the squirrel's gonna want to. Let's count them. One, two, three, four, five. What color are they? Kind of brown. Yes, like the squirrel is brown. All right, hold up five fingers. So if you hold up five fingers like this, you can make believe that they're your five brown acorns. Your other hand can make believe it's the squirrel coming to eat the acorns. See if you can follow. Follow what I do. It starts like this. Furry squirrel saw five brown acorns hanging from a tree. Furry squirrel saw five brown acorns hanging from a tree. So he grabbed one acorn and he crunched it hungrily. Make believe, just make believe you're eating that acorn. Leaving one, two, three, four, four brown acorns up hanging from the tree. Furry squirrel saw four brown acorns hanging from the tree. Furry squirrel saw four brown acorns hanging from the tree. So he grabbed one acorn and he crunched it hungrily. Leaving one, two, three, three brown acorns are hanging from the tree. If you think you're catching any of the words, will you help me sing? Furry squirrel saw three brown acorns hanging from the tree. Good. Furry
every squirrel saw three brown acorns hanging from the tree. So he grabbed one acorn and he crunched it hungrily, leaving one, two, one, two, two brown acorns are hanging from the tree. Furry squirrel saw two brown acorns hanging from the tree. Furry squirrel saw two brown acorns hanging from the tree. So he grabbed one acorn and he crunched it hungrily, leaving I left one brown acorn a hanging from the tree. Good, one last time. Do you think we can sing it a little bit louder? A little more forte, ready? Furry squirrel saw one brown acorn hanging from the tree. Good. Furry squirrel saw one brown acorn hanging from the tree. So he grabbed one acorn and he crunched it hungrily. Leaving no more acorns a hanging from the tree. Good, he ate them all up. How do you think Furry Squirrel's feeling right now? Maybe he has a full tummy. Maybe he's feeling full. Maybe he's feeling like, oh my goodness, I shouldn't have eaten all five of them. Now I have a tummy ache. I wonder if he's thinking that. Or maybe he's thinking, boy, I'm really tired now. I need to have a little rest. Do you think he's thinking that? Or maybe he's feeling kind of happy. Oh, I was so lucky to get all of those acorns. They were so delicious. I wonder if he's feeling happy. Maybe. Hey, will you help me count them as I put them back? I need to put them back the way they were, right? All right, help me, please. One, two, three, four, five. Now they're ready for next time. There. All right. So do you remember what color were the acorns? Brown. Yes, like the furry squirrel is brown. Let's do a song about colors. All right. When I sing about a certain color, and I'm going to show you a scarf that's a certain color, you're going to have to do something if you're wearing the color that I sing about. So check out your clothes. Um, and if I sing about a certain color, let's say that I start with the color blue. Blue. And if you're wearing blue, you might have to do something. Are you ready? Blue, blue, it's the color I see. If you're wearing blue, show it to me. Stand up, stand up if you're wearing blue. In your pants or your shirt or your socks, maybe on your shoes, who knows? Stand up, turn around, show me your blue, and then sit down. And have a seat. Get ready for the next color. Do you do that behind? 
you back. Ruby ring, ruby ring, where are you? Here I am, here I am. How do you do? Back, back, back. Baby small, baby small, where are you? Here I am, here I am. How do you do? Back behind your back. Fingers all, fingers all, where are you? Here we are, here we are. How do you do? Nice. All right, get ready. Elbow and hand like that. Wave your hand and then do the switcheroo. Very good. Skidamarinkadink. Skidamarinkadink, skidamarinkadoo. I love you, I love you. Skidamarinkadink, skidamarinkadoo. I love you, yes I do. I love you in the morning and in the afternoon. I love you in the evening and underneath the moon. Skidamarinkadink, skidamarinkadoo. Twinkle, twinkle, little star. Alrighty, I'll get the pretty sound for twinkle, twinkle. There it is. I'll make it a little bit quieter. Not so forte, not so loud. A little bit more piano. Can you make your, your hands, your fingers into stars twinkling? with you. Thanks for joining me and thank you to the Abbott Public Library in Marblehead for sponsoring my program. Thank you very, very, very much. Now it's time to wave to the beat like this for our silly see you later song. Listen to all the funny rhyming words. There's a bunch of rhyming words, songs that sound, words that sound alike in this song. Are you ready? Thank you. 
thanks for joining me and thanks for singing songs. I'll see you again. And thanks again to the Abbott Public Library. Thank you. Bye-bye.